Hello everyone, welcome back to Evie's Queen. I hope you guys are doing great. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you are new here and thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for subscribing to our channel and helping us to reach 1000 subscribers. We want to go further with you guys, so stay tuned to Evie's Queen. After Chinese New Year in mid-January, Tesla took the lead in lowering prices. Many car companies follow suit in China. Entering March, this price war continues to spread with major companies including BYD, Chang'an and Cherry joining. On March 9, BYD's official WeChat account showed that from March 10th to March 31st, BYD's two main models will carry out a special limited time pr promotion. Order the BYD Song Plus model for only 88 RMB to obtain a 6,888 RMB, which is 1,000 US dollars discount. On March 11, Cherry announced via social media that its Cherry Exceed J Tour and Cherry New Energy brand will introduce price cuts to promote automobile consumption and boost the development of uh, automobile industry. Specifically, Cherry brand models have an official discount between 10,000 to 31,000 RMB, which is 1,400 to 4,000 400 US dollars. For example, the official discount of the Cherry Arizo 8 is 19,000 RMB and the discount of the Cherry Tigo 8 Plus is 31,000 RMB. Recently, FAW launched a price reduction campaign with 100 million RMB, which is 14.5 million US dollars worth of subsidies in the Jilin province from March 1st to March 31. The scope of subsidies covers passenger cars and light trucks under FAW Honky, FAW JFang, FAW Bastion, FAW Volkswagen, and FAW Toyota. The subsidy amount varies depending on the purchase price and vehicle type from 5,000 RMB which is 7,020 US dollars to 37,000 RMB which is 5,300 US dollars. So far, at least 30 auto brands have participated in this price war with a maximum discount of more than 100,000 RMB, which is 15,000 US dollars. To promote consumer spending on cars, Chinese car makers, dealers, and local governments have joined forces to find ways to cut prices. The discounts are offered in the forms of direct purchase price cuts, cash credits, insurance subsidies, and gift packages. First, the sales volume is declining and inventory is high, so the price has to be reduced. For example, in 2022, Dongfeng Nissan sales fell by 20.9% year-on-year, Dongfeng Honda fell by 17.8%, SAIC Volkswagen fell by 14.7%, and GAC Honda fell by 6.2% according to Dongfeng. The cumulative sales of Dongfeng Citroen C6 in 2022 was only 3,080. Two units. Second, it is impacted by the new energy vehicle market. Most of the joint venture brands manufacture mainly ICE vehicles, which led to an increase in inventory when consumers prefer to buy new energy vehicles due to government subsidies. Moreover, the bigger stock came when new energy vehicles have vigorously started a collective price reduction. For example, Tesla claimed not long ago that the cost of building a car can be reduced by 50%. Consumers have a strong wait and see mode, which also puts a lot of pressure on fuel vehicles. If the production and sales are too low, the production lines would not be able to maintain operations. Therefore, in order to maintain factory operation, it is necessary to reduce prices to increase orders which is a common method used by second and third tire car companies. If a car company shuts down for a long time, its supply chain will gradually break down, which means the closure of the company. Third, starting from July 1st, 2023, heavy-duty vehicles are required to meet the national 4B emission standards forcing ICE vehicles to clean inventory. To sum it up, just around the same time last year, companies including Tesla, Xpeng, Hosen, GAC, Aeon, BYD, and Polestar collectively announced price increases on their electric vehicle models, ranging from a few thousand RMB to tens of thousands of RMB increase. Due to a combination of factors such as the raw material prices, now we are seeing an opposite shift. This kind of price war is not a zero-sum game, but a negative-sum game. That is it for today. Thank you for watching the video. Have a great day.